The communal living of those dang Mormons. Reinstitute what they consider an essential Mormon faith. Now, America. You know, even Muslims went to their own home. At, at the end of a day of prayer, everyone went to their own home. It wasn't a commune. Good for them. Now, America has had two main periods in which numerous communities were formed. The first occurred in the 1840s. You know what? Those cults, they don't respect your personal privacy. That's the, that's the contrast between a cult. The contrast between Islam and a cult is that a cult will actually, or Islam actually respects your privacy. They don't like establish surveillance cameras in your home or, you know, they don't check up if you came to, wait, what are you talking about? We're supposed to be talking over each other. Wait, what happened to your side of the sermon here? <laughs> hey, I'm in no man's land. Is anyone here? I'm blind. The shameful commune is a small minority of the whole. The ride of the first winter continued for many years. A few survived in the second and third generations. Those that survived do so because of a strong organization that can stay at they off of the companion world of the world to abandon their peculiar ways. Yeah, they gotta get more and more evil. <laughs> okay, yeah, they gotta get more evil, okay. Okay, okay they gotta get closer to Satan, okay. Yeah. They gotta get closer to Satan because the day of judgment's coming closer, okay. And a strong ethos, usually a particular religion. That serve both to separate the group from the world and to bind the members of the group closely together. Too much interaction with non members, especially with persons to whom members might have emotional ties. Okay, a, a religion that, that tries to keep it all to itself and save and writes, writes, uh. Okay, a religion that only saves its own people, okay. With the world. Oh, okay, exclusive salvation, okay, yeah. They change their names of helping to group yarding in rituals and old secrets. Oh, okay, so secret rituals are the way of salvation, okay. Yeah. They have clear logic and or rational within the context, but which, but learned on by an outsider, can appear sinister, psychotic, or just plain weird. Now, Okay, go through the motions, get get your salvation, okay. Sex is a powerful force that if uncontrolled can destroy a communal group quickly. Communal groups usually adopt one of two patterns. Oh, okay. Sexual slavery and uh, brainwashing. Okay, yeah, sexual slavery and brainwashing. Yeah. 